today, and today we're going to be uh, using icon art again, but this time we're going to be learning to animate our mouse cursors. As you can see with mine, it keeps flashing MTH. So yeah, today we're going to be learning how to use, uh, not learning how to use, learning how to make uh, these. So yeah, firstly, if you don't have icon art, you can check my other video out on how to get it, but I'll just run through it briefly here. Google.com and search for icon art. Download icon art free software to use. Download, voila, you've got it. Okay, so basically, you want to open up a new project and you've got all this here, right? Um, I, oh, I've just noticed something, but never mind it. <laughs> um, we're on icons and not cursors, but it still works. What you want to do is get a single frame here, and uh, this, you can choose two size or two size extended or two size complete. You know, but w what we're going to do is work on a single frame here, um, and click accept. There we have one single frame, right? What you want to do is come to icon, insert frame after current, or press F5. So I'm going to press F5 three times, okay? Now the first one is what it's going to look like, uh, okay? So we're just going to get a box from three across, one, no, five across, two down, and drag it all the way out, and then create our pointer, like so, okay? Um, and that's just got our body. And we're going to go to the next frame, and again, one, two, three, four, five across, three down, two down, sorry. Create our pointer. It's probably, in the, yeah, it's uh, done something wrong there. It's uh, in the wrong place. Let me just check that. That's one, two, three, four across, three down. Four across, three down. It should be there. Okay. Well, we'll just have that as the cursor anyway. And then again, across again, one, two, three, four, go to your third frame, one, two, three, four, five, three, down. and create your body, and three downs there, and you've got your point now, no, it doesn't look like much, but there we are, so then what you're going to do is you can add colours or insert text, but we're going to insert some text, so, I am MTH, multi tech help. So we're going to just do a simple one like me. And make it bold. And apply on the first one. And there you are. That's all you need. And then on the second one, icon, insert text. Just click apply again straight away. So it's in the same position. And then go back to icon text. And there you have it. And then you want to. Oh, no, you don't. You want to go to the third one, icon insert text, oh it's gone, damn M, uh, oh and it's still in the same place and there you have it, you've got three M's this time, go back to your second frame and get a T and position it, or well, not a T but whatever you're gonna whatever you're planning to make and then there's my T and apply, that's me got MT insert text, I'm not happy with that actually just wanna move it along a little Damn. Alt Z, get rid of it. Insert text. Back. Okay, apply now. Yep, that's much better. And then go to your third one, insert text, and do the T straight away again. Then remain on the third one this time, and choose. I'm going to choose H because it's the final one I want to do. And. MTH. Bye. This me got MTH, okay, and as you can see, the progress goes from M to MT to MTH. As I click through it, you can see it changes. Usually, the cursor here, like the point that we're having, it would stay the same, but as you can see, it moves from frame to frame because of my not so good of doing it. Okay, I then you come up to icon and preview animation, and as you can see here, it flashes. Yeah, good. Just flashing quite fast, and you might not want it to flash that fast. So what you're gonna want to do is come over to interval and change it. 
and we can change it to 350 and then play and see how it slows down yep I'm happy with it being at 300 choose your hotspot each one accept accept okay and that's us now if you want you can I guess you can add color um, around the sides like so I'm gonna get a yellow and go there to there and then on this one I'll be from there down to there down to there and the third one we're going from there to there to there to there and back up to the top to join and again you can see the progress on the yellow icon preview animation and you see the yellow border come around nice and slow it's quite a bright color you can't really see it that well so we'll change it to black see if that comes out a little bit better so that's basically it that's how you make animated curses um, yeah preview animation and there you see the black outline it comes in a little bit better uh, oh and saving file save any cursor and the saving as an animated cursor that's what you want to do and mth any2 and there we have our cursor done thanks for watching